For language development today, boys and girls, we are going to talk about some fun things today. Now, do you see what's on my face? Glasses. Glasses. Now, I have glasses, and usually when we talk about glasses, we talk about them saying this. I have a pair of glasses. Say that word with me. Uh, pair. Say the word pair. 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 Now, I'm not talking about a fruit, a pair. I'm talking about a pair of glasses. If your mommy says, I can't find my glasses, can you go find me a pair of glasses or a pair of sunglasses? Maybe she has lots of glasses. And so the reason why they're called a pair of glasses is because there are two lenses. Count with me. One, two. A pair are things that come in twos. Like we have two socks. Well, we have two what? Hands. We have two hands, don't we? Show me your hands. These are a pair of hands because we have two of them right here. So there's two hands. We have two what? Uh. Eyes. So we have a pair of eyes. Some are blue, some are brown. What color are your eyes, Angelina? Blue. They're blue. What color are your eyes, Oakley? Brown. Brown. What color are your eyes, boys and girls watching? Oh, green, and I heard black and brown, and I heard blue as well. Good. So we have some things on our body that we have two of, don't we? We have two ears, we have a pair of eyes, we have a pair of hands right here. Now, there's something that we can put on our hands that would be a pair of something. We wouldn't just use one. What do you think that would be? Mittens. So let me show you these mittens right here. There are two of them. Count with me. One, two. two. There are two mittens. The reason why these are called mittens and not gloves is because mittens, you put all of your fingers in. There's not a spot for all of your fingers. So I have two pair. These are little kid mittens. Two pair of mittens. I wouldn't go outside with just one, would I? No, I wouldn't do that. I would, then it wouldn't be a pair of mittens. I wouldn't be wearing a pair of mittens. I would just have one on. Now, what if I had, I don't have two pairs here, but what if I had this one on and then a plain white one? Would that be a pair? No. no, because they're not the same. A pair is also something that is two that are the same. The same. If I put two girls up here, that would be the same. Now, they wouldn't look alike, but two girls are a pair of girls because they're two. Or two boys, there would be two boys, so they would be the same. Now, let's look right here. How about this right here? What are these? Feet. Feet or two or shoes. So these are a pair of shoes. But what if, let's look. Let's look at my shoes. Do I have the same pair of shoes on? No. Look right here on my feet. Do I have, I do, I have the same pair of shoes on because they're both yellow. Now I have to tell you something funny. Mrs. Stewart has gone out of the house with two different shoes on. I've done it before. I've worn a blue shoe and a black shoe that looked exactly the same and didn't realize it when I got put them on in the morning until I got out. Now today I have both the same shoes on. So I am wearing a pair of shoes because they're exactly the same, exactly the same. But if I went to school with one yellow shoe and this shoe on, would I be wearing a pair of shoes? No, no. no I'd be two, wearing two different shoes. They would not be a pair. How about this right here? I have two little socks. They're cute little socks, aren't they? They have little mice on them. There are a pair of socks because they are the what? They're the same. Because they're what? The same. The same. But I have another one right here. Are these a pair of socks? Yes. Yes, because they are the what? Same. They're the same. But what if I went out of the house with this one and this one on? Would these be a pair of socks? No. No. When mommy is trying to do the laundry and she's putting the socks together at Mrs. Stewart's house, ah, there is a big laundry basket full of socks and we have to go through them and try to find the pairs, the things that match together. So if I put this sock and this sock together and I folded it together, would it be a pair? No. No, it would not be a pair. Hmm. How about this right here? What are these? Earrings. Earrings. These are beautiful earrings. Do you know Mrs. Stewart's done that before too? 
I've walked out of the house with two different earrings on or just one earring in my ear and forgot to put the other earring in my ear. Would I be wearing a pair there? No. No, I have to have the same pair in my ears. Right now, I have these earrings and these are the same and these are the same. So these are a pair of earrings and these are a pair of earrings. But if I put this one on and this one on, would they be a pair? No. No, because they're not the what? Same. They're not the same, but when you have two of the same, it's called a what? Pair. A pair. Good. These are a pair of earrings. Now look right here. What are these? Boots. Boots. These are fun rain boots that you can splash in the water with. And what are these? Boots. boots. So this is a boot and this is a boot, but if I put them together, are that is that a pair of boots? No. No, because they're not the what? They're not the same. So this is a pair. These are fun black rain boots. Oh, they're so shiny and fun. And these are fun little fun boots with stars on them. So this is a pair and this is a pair. But these together are not a pair, are they? No. no. Now, now you say, I have something else here fun. Look at this. Scissors. Scissors. But how many scissors do I have? One. One, but do you know it's called a pair of scissors? If I needed something and I might say, Connor, will you go get me a pair of scissors? I wouldn't say, Connor, get me scissors. I would say, would you get me a pair of scissors? Do you know why? Because look, it's got two blades on it. These are two blades and I'm holding it carefully because we have to hold them carefully. We don't want to get hurt. So see how it has one right here? and one right here. So there's two of them together make a pair. So these are a pair of scissors. So what are these? Pairs. What are these? Glasses. They are glasses, but what are they? They are a pair. a pair of glasses because they have two what? What are these called? This glass part right here, these are called lenses. 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 So this is a pair, even though I don't have two in my hand, two different pairs of glasses that look alike, these are considered a pair because there are two parts, two lenses. Your eyes, those are a pair. This pair, this is, these scissors are a what? A pair. pair. These boots together are a, a pair. But what are these? Not a, Not a pair. Good. Isn't it fun to learn about pairs? You can go home and look at your house to see what you have that are exactly alike, that are pairs of things. And maybe you could come back and tell me all about it. Boys and girls watching, you could be looking. Maybe you could even help mommy at home put the pairs of socks together. That would be a really big help.